I want to tell you some of the reason why it looks like when guys make it, they don't fall in love. Or rich guys don't fall in love. Yes. I want to tell you the reason why it looks like um, that guy made it and forgot about you. I want to tell you the reason why that guy is refusing to marry you now that he has made it. Rather, he wants to pay you off for those that have conscience. Rather, he wants to pay you off and so that you will go and um, he's going to manage someone else. Most times, most of you, most of we ladies go about complaining. Eh, I stayed with him when he had nothing. I was there for him when he had nothing. It is not about being there for him. That's just the strange truth about it. Being there for a man when he had nothing, it, it means little or nothing to him most times. What means more to him is when you were there for him, how loyal and how sincere you were to him. I don't know if you know. See, and most times we ladies make this, make this mistake of thinking that these guys doesn't know what we are up to. Or what we are doing. Or what we've been doing. Or what we have done. No, no, Ibu. They know. It's just that because he's broke at the moment. Because he cannot afford that luxury life that you want. Because he knows that he can't even talk you out of what you are putting yourself into. He just decides to play along. Because at that point where he's broke, you're the only one that might accept to give him free pekus. That will, that will agree to give him free knack. Because he might not be able to afford knack. Probably the way he wants it. So you're the only available person to give him free knack. And he knows that when you are giving him that free knack, you are not, he's not the only one you are giving. He, he knows that he's broke. And you've been following other guys. You've been seeing other guys. You've been taking money from other guys. Other guys have been knocking you. You've been doing hook up. He knows. But he might not want to confront you. Because he might probably confront you. And you start ranting. You, you, you seize no opportunity to remind him of how broke he is. How he cannot take care of you. How, how this and how that. And no, man's want, no man wants his ego to be trampled upon. So he will just allow you to do your thing. Yes. He will just allow you to keep doing your thing. See, there's something that we ladies don't know, right? When a man is broke, you cannot dictate his loyalty. When a man is broke, you cannot dictate how he's going to react when he has money. You can't react. So don't assume to know a broke man. You don't assume to know how, how loyal he is, how this and how that he is. Until he makes money. Now, the reason why it also looks like when a guy made money, he forgot about you. is because at that time when he was broke, we were busy jumping from one car to another. Jumping from one state to another. Jumping from one, from one uh, club to another. He knows all of that. See, when it comes to eternity, eh? when it comes to a long-term thing, a man will always choose a loyal lady over a beautiful lady. When it comes to an eternity thing, a man choose a loyal lady over a lady that was there giving him free pekus when he was broke. Not because... Uh, 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 maybe you were pitying him and be giving him free pekus, but you were no loyal to him. Loyalty most times matters a lot to most men. I don't know if you get. Loyalty most times matters a lot to most men. So, the moment you are dating that guy and you know that you are not being loyal to him, the moment you know, to, the mo the moment you know that you are dating that guy and you are disrespecting him, you do not seize every opportunity to remind him of how broke he is. You call him a failure, you call him names and all of that. You even cheat to his face because you think he cannot afford you. Believe you me, the moment that guy makes it, he's leaving you. He's leaving you. And that is why most women will come out and start saying things like, eh, men don't like, uh, the man, men don't like marrying women that suffered with them. Men don't like doing this. Men. Because when it comes to eternity, men choose loyalty over beauty. When it comes to a long-term thing, men choose respect over, o -o over disrespect. Which every other person is going to go for. Respect is key. 
Yes. So it's not about staying with the bro guy. It's not about dating the bro guy. It's were you respecting him that time he was broke? Were you loyal that time he was broke? Because every man is going, less going to think, this girl that wasn't loyal to me when I was broke, she's now coming now because I already have money. That is why she's coming to act loyalty. And every other person is going to think so. They will see you like you're just coming to them because they now have uh, small money, because they are no longer broke. That is why you're now coming to them. And truthfully, that is what it is. So while you're dating that your broke guy, if you know you cannot be loyal to him, if you know you cannot be humble, if you know you cannot respect him, just don't expect anything in the future. Just keep dating him for dating. If, you, if your luck shines in the future, he ends up marrying you, it's your luck. But if your luck doesn't shine, just know that it, 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 it is not, it's neither his fault or your fault. Because it's not your fault in the sense that you need maintenance as a lady that you are. You need to look good at every point in time. And him too, he, need, he knows he cannot afford you. So that's why I said it's neither your fault or his fault. Let us stop making these men look like they are, they are heartless. Men always do know what they want, no matter how broke they are. No matter how they cannot afford uh, 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 the good life he desire at the moment, but they still know what they want.